Hello Fire Signs, welcome back to the Star Card Channel. I am here to do a reading for your month of July 2021. Guys, please remember to like, share, subscribe. If you're already here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and click on that bell so that you're notified each and every time I do bring you reads. Alright, let's see here. <clears throat> What's going on, fire signs? July 20 of 21. Fire signs. Fire signs. Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. What's going on? July of 2021. You know, I did a reading for Aquarius, Libra, and Gemini, the air signs, and they had the exact same card. So if you are intertwining with an air sign, check out their reading as well. All right, it looks like there is someone that is feeling as if I'm hearing pull cards so oh my gosh these same cards let's see something here telling me to do something different so okay <laughs> these are almost the same cards almost exactly. all right <clears throat> It looks like there was some type of relationship, uh, some type of bond, where you felt as though uh, this person was not actually, um, you weren't connecting the way that you guys used to. Um, it looks like there was some type of third party relationship uh, that might have brought some frustration into your relationship. Uh, you could have been the individual involved with the other person or it could be your other party. Um, however, it's something that left you feeling stressed, uh, something um, that had you actually researching whether or not this is a situation or, um, yeah, whether or not this is a situation that you want to stay in. It seems that um, maybe you guys got to a point where things were not adding up. Um, so there could have been some truth that was actually disposed on you. Or there could have been um, on the opposite side of the tracks where you had another individual expose you for um, being unfaithful and untruthful to them. So it looks like there is a relationship ending, but there's also a beginning here for a new relationship. There's somebody that you feel that has come into your life. Um, you feel that this, this individual is your cup of tea, meaning you're wanting everything with them, the house, the home, the kids. Um, this person might have children already, or maybe you could. Uh, to be honest, you and a the air signs readings um fire signs these cards are almost exactly the same so i'm not sure if air and fire is um what's actually you know together right now but it seems like you guys have the same exact story the spread is the same and everything you can go back and look at the reading however this person that's coming in you feel comfortable with them um I'm hearing that you feel as if you can be yourself. So it's somebody that's also been making you hold um, something that's been having you vibrant. Just a second. It's a business call. 
Okay, guys, sorry about that. This person uh, seems as if they are somebody that is caring, somebody that you actually feel the love. There's sort of a, a vibrant sort of energy um, getting when you guys are together. Um, this person is someone that you see is got their shit together, pretty much, okay? So they might uh, be single or newly single coming out of a relationship, but someone that you see that you're able to flourish with. Uh, you and this person right now, you're in a situation or a situation ship where you actually are seeing eye to eye and you both have plans for the same thing, which is to move forward with a relationship. Let's see here. What else for fire signs? Fire signs. I'm hearing something about I just want to get rid of the past. So maybe you're trying to, you know, you're now moving away from this other person that you were probably involved with previously. And you're just wanting to, to get away from, from wall of what you guys have been going through. So July again um you guys are i think you're falling in love with an um air sign um somebody that definitely has you feeling balanced uh cup full and into you um this person gives you something i'm hearing a, a drive um it's like maybe to you uh, this person is a, a whole different vibe a different energy there's some type of um I'm hearing, I'm not sure if you're getting like a healing, a healing sense from this person. So maybe the way that they talk to you, the way that you guys um, are experiencing each other at the moment, it's it's really on a high vibrational um, stance. It seems like you and this individual are vibrating um, tremendously on high notes, which is, which is awesome. Definitely awesome. Wow. It seems like you just left what you left. Um, the grass was definitely and is going to be greener on the other side. Let's see here. July. July 2021. July. 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 Yeah, there's definitely an ending coming, and that's most likely the ending that you've already experienced if this has not happened yet. You are physically working on moving forward. You're working on developing something with your new person. You're working on being who you need to be, and you're trying to do this quickly. You are definitely trying to get out of Dodge, out of of this relationship you want no parts of what this uh, uh this old individual is offering so i'm not sure if they're trying to persuade you to stay inside of a, a relationship uh, where there's not um there's no trust but definitely you have a cup but you've definitely got it for somebody else there's somebody else that you are now focused on so maybe this old person has waited until the last minute to do something about the way they act towards you or the way they treat you and at the moment you've already locked eyes on someone else and so you're in the process of taking that leap of faith of moving forward getting rid of any anxiety that you may have and definitely um, you're moving into something it looks like something that's going to be beautiful it could be an individual from the past that's coming popping back up um, that you're going to be that you are vibing with um, I'm hearing maybe this person hits you up on social media um, if you've got Instagram or Facebook um, Lindink this person might have actually found you there 
and I don't think it was a sense of them going to look um, yes You've been trying to juggle in between what you should do, but I think you already know that there is uh, just too many, too much of arguing, too much of being frustrated with the person that you were already with. And so you are definitely trying to move forward, moving away from them. Um, and that's meaning that you're going to most likely already change homes or you're in the process of changing homes. You've got your shit together and maybe they do not uh, they haven't been working on, on their goals they haven't been trying to get themselves to where they need or where you need them to be it's just been on the other end where you've been fighting you've been staying up in the air trying to decide and the whole time you've actually been receiving messages from the guy that's trying or guy or female that's trying to come back into your life but they're coming straight and forward um, they actually have something to offer there's great communication there um, what they're trying to do is the same thing that you'd like to do, which is to bowl, to build, excuse me, to build a family with you, to progress, to move forward. You're sick of being in a selfless relationship. It seems to me as if you felt maybe there was some type of downfall or some something that occurred. However, it left you feeling as if you were lonesome. And at this moment, you're going to end up telling the truth. You are tired of being undecided about what you should do and feeling like you should wait you've definitely waited on this to come and it's finally here and now your seeds are actually prospering so you're moving forward i see you moving forward with someone else i think it's going to be an air sign and the reason i said that if you go back and look at their reading you guys got almost the same cards almost all of them i believe except two off the top so there's some type of connection um, that the air signs and the fire signs have at this moment where you guys are vibrating on the same, the same sense right now. Um, and whatever you're trying to create, it's going to come together. It's like maybe to me, the air signs are being handed something. They're being handed what they've actually prayed for, they've wished for. And it looks like whatever fire sign they've been dealing with, <clears throat> if it's been you <clears throat> or if it's the actual air sign that's going to be um, coming into your life, you guys are, are, are going to do good together. It looks like it's going to be something that's going to be fruitful. You've already started it out on a good foot and a good note. All right, guys, so I want to thank you, thank you, thank you so much to my fire signs for joining me. Please remember to like, share, subscribe, turn on those post notification bells so that you guys are updated each and every time I do bring you reads. And as always, talk to you later. Bye.